Hello everyone, and let's check out Skyforge, shall we? Decided to check this game out. It's been open beta, and it's been been out for a while now in open beta. What the hell is wrong with the character? She has a pixelated face. Nope. She is, of course, a paladin. Look at that. We're a knight of righteous fury with sunglasses on because we want to look cool. And you know, you want to look cool wearing sunglasses. Get your choice of class here. Uh, you can change class on the fly. You got the Lightbringer, which is like a healer class. You got your Paladin, which is a tank. And you got your Cryomancer, which is a DPS. We're a Paladin. Want to be a Knight of Righteous Fury. Right here. So you got our bubble. This, this, this. Oh, I like that. So it is a, a very kind of... I am busy. Hit that guy. There we go. Space bar to pick things up. Need some credits. It's a kind of you are a you're a god. I mean, you play as a character, then you die, then you get resurrected as a god. No, I haven't really been paying attention to the story. We have to go in this direction. Ah, we can we can dodge with shift, not sprint with shift. There you go. So number one is our dash, force leap type thing into the action. Go in into the air, pick that up. Number two is our Shield of Righteousness. The sun is calling. I assume it's a Shield of Righteousness. We are a paladin. But we're gonna fight this fucker right here. Nice, a bit of lightning, a bit of combo. Oh, he missed. What does K do? So you click the left and right mouse button, you do a big uppercut thing in here. That's pretty damn cool. Get some credits out of that. Credits take it as our currency. Well, let's head off in this direction and we'll do a quick first impressions video. This is. Wow, there are quite a lot of them. How did we miss this? This must be where the attacks are coming from. Okay, scouty dude. Where are they coming from? Probing action. Aww. I think the graphics look weird. I've got it set to medium. What the hell is this thing? Hit space to. Oh, there's a big boss dude up there. The Go help him out. Pretty dangerous. Be right. careful. He's number four, dude. Oh, there we go. There we go. Three paladins taking them on. Press F to receive your reward. Okay. We got Sparks of Destruction and a Ring of Courage. Well, we are a paladin. What do we do? Abilities, bag. Ring of Courage gives us three strength, three valor. Might as well take it. There we are. The character model, it does it does have medium anti-aliasing, but it doesn't seem to have any anti-aliasing. We get four rings, which is pretty cool. We've got the Ring of Courage. What have we got? Oh. Ring of Luck, which is strength and luck. This is strength and valor. What does valor do for us? Our prestige. Take it, that's our level. What is. Oh, minus six prestige. 382, whatever that is. Prestige. Got no weapon, apparently, but we haven't got a weapon. What is, does it tell you where the. Uh, this is our abilities. Execution is our E ability. Then I'd open that. So what does what does the uh, stats do? Valor increases bonus damage. Valor does. Might increases base damage. Strength increases maximum base damage. Okay. Luck is crit. 
And better is pulse damage, strangely. So I guess as a tank, what we want to take as a tank. Stamina, obviously. And I guess base damage. I guess we probably want that as a tank as well, I'd imagine. Right, return to the scout. We get that threat eliminated with the help of our fellow paladin brethren. See? Warriors of the light, we stick together. I picked it, because it looks cool as shit. Dank. Dank it. I, I like the way the text pops up there. Cool. Big. Righteous shield. We need a bigger shield. The paladin needs a big, giant, oversized shield. I like the way it changes. Whenever you equip it, it like changes size. When you have it out, put it away, it collapses in itself. Pretty damn cool. I like it. Alright, let's go and find Scout. Who's this called? Scout. Hey, Scout, buddy. Thanks for your help. His the birds are changed. no longer a threat to any of the neighboring towns. You've dyed your beard, haven't you? We'll destroy every single in one the... of their nasty burrows. He had. I'm sure his beard was black. In the in the cutscene. In well, when he was on the side. When he was on the side of the screen. What's our reward? What do we get? With premium, without premium. We're not going with premium. Argus system. Press B and double click the weapon. Um, okay. Alright, the bag. So double click the. Ah, oh, you double click it to open it. There you go. We've got a rod of light. We've got a sword of justice. Oh, yeah. A big sexy sword of justice because we're a paladin, not a rod of light. Take it to Lightbringer, Paladin, Gyromancer. We're gonna. Open P and select the slot. Weapon. That's pretty easy to equip. There we go. We're up to. Alright. Okay, let's go back. Report. This is a pretty cool game. It is a very. It's kind of like DCUO in its combat system. In that, well, as a DCUO with reticule based combat, in that you use left click and right click to generate combos in that sense, and you've got your uh, action buttons at the top. The combat's pretty cool. Pretty fast paced, and ooh, are we crashing? No, we're not crashing. Congratulations, you've received the reward for logging into the game. Sweet. Log into game seven days in a row to receive all the rewards. What do we get? We get a costume. We get... I don't know what that is. We get some credits. Ooh, credits. What do we get day one? Day one we get... Two thousand... What's a spark of destruction? Can unlock red nodes and increase your damage. Ooh, let's receive 20k credits. Now oh, we can double tap the button to move. You can see it's a pretty good looking game actually. It's quite a nice looking game. We don't think we wanna go. Do we wanna go to the shuttle or do we wanna we wanna go talk to her, I guess. Your achievements fill my heart with joy. Oh, Aelon needs brave warriors. Oh yeah, I'm brave Mortals warrior. aren't always strong enough to fight off these. So beasts, you're a god, so basically. Must help them. The most you're a, you're a GSI droid. You is their faith it. in you. The more yeah, mortals believe, believe in, in me, you, the more powerful you become. An immortal must be able to channel that faith when needed. I'm a paladin with sunglasses. The you received is the kind of god you want to be. To use this gift, you will need the Ascension Atlas. Flavius will explain it. Oh, let's go see Flavius then. We're not space barring with righteous fury. Where the hell's Flavius? The research center. Where's the research center? Ah, take the shuttle terminal. I see it. I see it. Ooh. Cool looking character model. Does it look any better when you're. No, it, their face looks pixelated. I've got the graphics set to medium. It recommended medium, so I just left it at medium. Research center then. Where do you want to go? Ah, we got a. Uh, a god space taxi, do we? Skip. Oh, well, we'll skip it then. It, it does look like Coruscant, doesn't it? There's this place, it really does. 
Uh, it does remind me a lot of the Republic capital in Swilltor. Guy's called Quakefist. Think Bell. I don't even remember what what's F8 do? F8 kind of thing. Ooh, day two, we'll get a hundred what is I don't know what Spark of Destruction does. Maybe someone will explain it. It's gotta see Flavius then. But I, I do like it. As it as it looker, it looks pretty cool. For crying out loud, I'm trying to work. Alright, All what dick. is it then? Don't tell me the interface is broken. Hey, oh, you don't you get a choice for the well combo. Then, time to learn about the Ascension Atlas. Wait a sec. Didn't I show it to you the last time? No, you didn't. No way I would have forgotten. My memory's like the Kraken's tentacle, tenacious and with suckers. But no matter, we'll fix everything. So you're Come a sucker on to the then. laboratory. It's time we met each other properly. Space bar to finish. Use the capsule. All immortals share the ability to delve into the deepest parts of their mind. But for now, you're going to need help from your care, she's like cool. nodding. I know that Maybe nod on the woman. Else's head to start. Oh crap! Don't break me. Here, this is an ascension atlas. Thought he was gonna put retinol in. That is the atlas is a map of mental and physical abilities of a person. Get some retinol done. abilities. Seems the like that type. Mind and soul, a symbiosis of an organism's opposite functions. If we could find a point where psyche meets physics, uh, it must be somewhere at the junction of the hemispheres. I like the, the music. It's pretty cool. I need to write this down. Don't forget to book the operating room on Tuesday. Oh, you're still here. What were we talking about? Oh, right. Tell me about nodes. The nodes. Yeah, there you go. Atlas nodes are new abilities, talents, and even classes. You unlock the nodes one by one, pursuing your own pathways and goals. Isn't that miraculous? So, um, what do you think? I think you should stop touching me. What I think. There you go. Press K to open the Ascension Atlas. Right, so what have we got here? To unlock a node in the Atlas, you have enough resources for Click it. So you get stamina and proficiency. Ooh. Do we have enough nodes? Ah, oh, there's a spark. Spark of destruction is for your atlas things, and you've got your sparks of creation is defensive stats, and sparks of balance, uh, unlock blue nodes. Blue, these are increased additional stats and leadership, as well as active symbols. Ah, okay. Okay, so as a tank, you would want the sparks of creation. Defensive stats, the destruction ones increase your damage. These cost 50, uh, they cost 50 blue ones, 50 green ones. That costs. No, we already, we've already unlocked that one, so we don't have any of these, so we uh, can't unlock anything here. Uh, what about other classes? If we were a gyromancer, yeah, it's gonna be. Uh, Bonus stamina, Lightbringer is stamina proficiency. Then it's spirit. We get a quasar. Creates a quasar in a selected area. Let's go back to the paladin, shall we? See what we get. Waves of anger. There you go. Deals 112, 130 damage over a few seconds. All enemies in the radius around the paladin. Divisibly does not require a target. Attack continues as long as the key is held down. Ah, cool. Can we unlock this without... Do not meet the... Yeah, we've got to... I take it we've got to get... Right, so we can't unlock anything. Press F to complete it. Maybe we'll get... Ah, there we go. So we'd get 75 if we were a premium. I guess premium is the subscription. Or at least the heightened model. It's a cool weapon that that guy's got. So we get our... Defense things. So we can now unlock this. We got 50 of them. Double click it. There we go. There we go. Your uh, prestige is. I take it is based on our gear and level. I take it is. 
kind of, I guess it's kind of like uh, Defiance is ego system, I'm guessing. Claim the reward, press F. What have we got here? We have a whatever the hell that is. Blue thing, blue orby thing. The capsule is from me. Don't thank me. You'll serve science. It's a prototype. We are going to see if there are any side effects. Reliquary to open it. Right, so double click the reliquary to open it. Contains some sparks. Not enough prestige. Ah, we needed the prestige to open it. Right. So what else did we get here? We got 40 of them. We can't use that because it costs 50. <laughs> Convenient. 100 sparks of destruction. Sparks of justice can unlock any nodes in the Paladin Atlas. By collecting, can obtain by... At least it tells you where it's obtained. So we're looking for... It's fairly linear. For this part, I mean, does it ever? We'll zoom out a bit and see if we can get a bit of choice. Be much. I mean, there seems to be. There's, it, ah, there we go. Branching choice there. It seems to be quite exhaustive. The Ascension Atlas, which is essentially your skill tree. So it starts off linear. You can zoom in a little bit, zoom out, and there's a few choices. So we get to here. Path of the Paladin. And then we head up to this one where we have choices here. We can go this way or this way and we've got a bunch of choices that we can make. So at least it's not linear in its approach. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Press F. Oh, we got a reward. Another reward. Jesus, we got a polo costume. Alright, awesome. Double click your costume icon. I've got a... Uh, how do we change it? Valuable. Um, that way. Rares, other rarities or ascension stuff we've already uh, already talked about. Unlock a new class. The style of room. There we go. There we go. We've got a. We could be a slutty paladin. Not a slutty paladin. We could be a badass paladin. We could be a. Uh, ah, it's got jiggle physics in it as well. You could be, uh, what was her name from Metal Gear Solid? What was her name again? From Metal Gear Solid 3. You could be her anyway. Uh, there it is. That, that, that was the color she had. What was her name? Ah, uh, what was her I can't remember. She was the one that, um, is the double agent at the end of Metal Gear Solid 3. It's not the boss, but it's essentially like that. It could be a... Slightly sluttier, a slightly less slutty paladin. We could be a paladin in a dress, which doesn't suit the paladin, to be honest. Fancy costume. Class costume, which is slutty armor paladin. <laughs> really? Uh, the Metal Gear Solid 3 paladin will be the badass paladin. Let's be the badass ones. At least you can customize this. Pretty, pretty good for customization, I suppose. Click on the costume icon to try it on and click save. Try on a costume, click the costume icon. Where's the costume? This is a uh, style room. Head where we were powered in the sunglasses, you know. It says click the costume. This says clothes. Ah, oh, there it is. Save to save it. Let's go with what we had. Ah, oh, that's pretty cool. There you go, just so that it progresses us in the quest line. There you go, we got a reward. I've heard about a certain event that might interest you. I'll be waiting for you in the Divine Observatory. Alright, we can only go Divine Observatory. Space bar like a pro. Like a pro, we're gonna space bar it. So it's a pretty interesting game. Well, I'm calling this place Coruscant, because it looks like Coruscant. 
Where's the Jedi Temple? Oh, it got destroyed, didn't it? We'll call this the Je we'll call this the Jedi Li- It is like the Jedi Library. It's very- it is very Star Wars-y. Oh, there's a gold spammer. Nice. Wouldn't be a free-to-play uh, MMO without the gold spammer. I gotta talk to uh, this lady again. Like a wise traveler filling his flask before each journey, you accumulate knowledge and experience. I'm glad to see that. Thank you. We received a distress Space signal from an keep alien listening. factory. Please, go and find out what happened there. It would be too dangerous for a novice, but not for you. Yeah, I'm level two, bitch. Too dangerous for a level one, but a level two? No problem. Factory 501. What to make, uh... What to make Levi jeans there. At Factory 501. Oh, we have to go this way. There we go, we'll get some Levi jeans out of it. Factory 501. Where are we going? There we go. Yeah, it is very, it is very Star Warsy. like. I mean, do we get to go to other planets? We're on this planet right here, it's pretty cool. Group finder, we could do it. Ooh, difficulty is hard. Ooh. We could launch it or we could do... Join a group for it. I don't think we'll join a group seeing as we're only doing a... All oh, right, it is a... It is a... It is actually a group thing. Well, we're a well, yes, we're tanking. Then let's go do some paladining. Reward, we get blue stuff for it. Oh no, we're not in a group. Ooh, that's a shiny floor. That floor is shiny. Let's see what the engineer has. Oh, he's got a cool oh, mustache. So every quest seems to be fun. voice acted, which is cool. We had a very strange failure in the night. The machinery came who to life and who so ruined the genes? What? Can't then the leave I five hundred one? The factory and there's no way to stop production. We've got to get to the main computer. Jesus, I'm doing everything. I told you we shouldn't try to Listen, dudes. You've ruined the Levi 501s for my paladin. He's a paladin in jeans. Execution! Got a bubble shield up. Yeah, you're a paladin. You've got a bubble, therefore you're a paladin. Can't be a paladin without a bubble. Ah, crap. There's my bubble. Alright, big AoE. Pounding in this one. We got some loot. Loot. <laughs> this is called loot. Collecting trophies receive. When you receive trophies, 25 is subtracted from the credit limit. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, I took a bit of a pounding there. Pick anything up? Get to this control panel. Execution! Oh yeah! You're executed with righteous fury. We didn't even need our shield up. See the control panel? It controls the power supply. Use it to fry a couple mechanoids. Ah. Guys, this thing won't 
lie. Oh shit, it's gonna self destruct right away. Done anything. I get all of them are dead, that's good. Oh no, this guy is dead. He is not that he messed with a paladin. Oh, what the hell is this thing? Nothing to look at. Ah, shit. Ow, ow, oh, ah, no, don't blind me! Son of a. Ow. I don't want to be blind. Ah, ah, that son of a bitch! I'm still out of control of the character, just running around. Just because. There you go. Got the combo off that time. Got some loot. Oh, fuck. Run away, run away. Wait, we're a paladin, we don't run from shit. Run from nothing. Seven times it's health bar, that's what it's got. Ah. Oop, that looks like a. Oh. Would be better with a controller. There we go. That's six health bars now. Four health bars. This is like as if we're gonna die. We got stunned. Health bars now. This is hard work. That no health bar at least. Sucker. Um, Levi's 50, Levi 501s are gonna be ours. Don't mess with our jeans. Don't come between a woman and clothing. That's one of the things you learn, especially a paladin. Oh shit, this fucker looks. Business this fucker. I need fucking around. Whoa. Don't 
like circles on the ground. This is squares on the ground. At least we get our health back after every fight. Squares on the ground. This is. Part of me thinks we're making more than jeans in this 501 factory. Get that factory. Oh crap. Get we out there. Destruction and dodge away. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Wanna stand there? It's a bad place to be. It's interesting, it's got interesting gameplay. I like the lighting effects, they're pretty cool. There we go, we're gonna go in and see where our jeans are at. Destroy the factory. Then I'll have to leave now. You must remain and make sure everything oh, that goes good. as planned. You can it's hold your own for... against a couple of immortals. Don't mess with a space paladin. Be glad. It is an honorable death. Oh, I said The next time you can go on this adventure with a group of up to three people, just like any other squad adventure. Ah, oh, cool. He's activated the energy shield. Ah! Control panels in oh, this room and disable the shield. Get to her! <laughs> 
Right, and disable the panels. That way we can kill this thing possibly. Yeah, yeah, don't stand in fire, I get it. Fucker! An execution. Mess with my divine righteousness. Son of a my righteous space paladining. Not stand in the deadly lasers. Things that kill us, deadly lasers. See, that's what you get when you mess with a paladin. Here we go. Oh, he's not got a lot of health. Stuff. And we've saved all the Levi jeans. Which is good. We got some blue. Yeah. Got a hold of the replicators. It's one of the yeah. So with premium, it's a great acquisition. Well, buy premium no status, I guess. We got some spheres of balance, which affect our abilities. I guess we'll need all of them as a tank. I imagine the green ones should be. I guess our priority as a tank but anyway that was that's all for this uh, first impression video so thank you for joining me for this it's a it's a pretty pretty cool game actually uh, it looks pretty interesting what does K do? K gives us our thing so we can access this anytime I'm guessing so just double click that there you go we got Spirit increased by seven. This will give us waves of anger. Let's go take this. Does it hit? It does do. It is a damage. There you go. Spend our destruction points. There you go. Zed is. Ooh, that was pretty cool. I like it. Don't like that it's on Zed though. I think we may have to change that up a bit. Change it maybe to a control two or something like that, hopefully in the key binding menu. But yeah. Interesting game, just entered open beta. I didn't deliberately held off on it uh, just when it entered open beta. Well you'll be gaining new knowledge much faster now. All thanks to me. I think I've already mentioned that. And then there's flat why do they look different from their portraits? That's the only thing that I don't like. So anyway, uh so cool game. In the end, this is the Jedi library, isn't it? Anyway, obvious Star Wars references aside, and pretty cool thing there, and with all the, uh, the little hollow records there. Down there, nice details about the game. Anyway, it's a cool game, you should check it out, it's available for free. Uh, you can download it, open beta, uh, it's in, so anyone can download it. But open beta is practically the release for a... for a... Uh, was it, a free-to-play game, you can think there. So, the, you get three classes to choose from. Uh, at the start, you can buy other classes, you can unlock other classes, I'm guessing. So anyway, we've went on for a long time. So anyway, thank you for joining me, and we'll see you again soon, and goodbye.